Hi, so I'm going to show you how to do the burrito method for the Create Your Own Skater Dress by Rad Patterns. So what you'll have done so far is you will have sewn your shoulder seams on both bodices and then you will have joined your bodice and your lining bodice via the neck. So you'll have sewn all the way around joining them. So what you need to do next is turn your fabric right side out. So bodices together, right side out. For this, it doesn't matter whether I've got the pink or the purple for the lining. Just I'm just showing you. So what you want to do is lift up one side where obviously your arm side is. Tuck the other underneath. So you'll have, on mine, I'll have a pink one which is right side up and a purple one right side up as well. Then what we want to do with the other part of your body, so the other arm side, is you need to now roll this really tightly, making sure you don't pull the other part in as well. And that is going to now sit in between So it's all tucked in there. So now we just need to do your clipping. I'm only going to put three in quick just to hold it together. So you will have a shape like this. Okay, and the other part is all neatly rolled up in there. So what we're going to do is just sew along this arm side, but make sure this is tucked well out of the way because we don't want to catch that. So I'm just going to pop over here. Make sure everything's lined up because I've not clipped it all the way around. Sorry, I've got the window open and it's just blown you over. I'm not going to worry about finishing off the seams just yet because I want to show you. So that's that all sewn. What you need to do now is pull out there you go so you have a completely seam free shoulder. Brilliant for people like myself who are autistic and really hate seams, especially those itchy ones you get here. I quite often take out seams and redo them myself so that they're flat lays and stuff like that if I've bought stuff. So now what we're going to do is we're going to roll this one, the one that you've just sewn, into the other one. So again, you want to separate it out so that it's right side up. And you want to roll 
it might be a bit chunkier this one as we just sewn it and clip and clip so again just got a funny little shape and everything's all tucked in there so just make sure when you're sewing it again that you're not catching any part of it my fifth sixth dress that I've made from this pattern um, I was quite lucky to have been able to test the pattern when it first got tested and it has become a staple in my wardrobe because there are so many options You can add the sleeve add-on pack to it, that works well. You can change up the bodice uh, to all the different things. This one that I've done is crew neck. Um, so I've done crew front and crew back. There you go. So it's all sewn. All you need to do now is just so your side ones, which is as easy as so in straight along there. So you've got your neck all in here, and then again on the other side, and then that's all sewn. And all you need to do then is attach your skirt. All right. Got any questions leave them in the comments below if you need any more help with anything just find me on rad patterns discussion group i'm one of the radmen over there and i can help you out with anything you might need all right see you later